Olympic sport at the 1988 Seoul Olympics, with singles and doubles competition for both men and women. Fun fact. Television coverage of the men's singles final attracted an astounding worldwide audience of almost 2 billion. In China, table tennis is still as popular as ever and is played by Lee Millions at work, school and in community parks. Loved by as many as 875 million people around the world and counting, table tennis is most definitely a force to be reckoned with. The name table tennis was adopted in 1921 when the Ping Pong Association that was formed in 1902 was revived. The game quickly gained popularity not only in England, but also Germany, Hungary, Sweden, Denmark, India, and a whole host of other countries that just couldn't get enough of the sport. It actually wasn't until 1900 that EC good the table tennis paddle that we are now so familiar with. Simply put, English firm J. Jax and Son came up with the name Ping Pong at the end of the 1800s, and it was later trademarked in the United States by Parker Brothers. As early as 1890, an Englishman named James Gibb invented the celluloid ball, and only a short time later, the first wooden racket was introduced. The origins of table tennis, like so many other racket games, can be traced back to the forerunners of tennis. Externally, however, not much of it is recognizable anymore, because table tennis did not develop from classical tennis, but is a side branch, so to speak. In the following time table tennis became more and more popular, although it was almost exclusively